Let's just wait on the Lord. The Holy Spirit speaking. And that's what He wants to do in our lives tonight. The Holy Spirit just said, I want to heal broken hearts here tonight. I want to heal broken hearts who will be watching this video. If you have a broken heart, if you have rejection in your life from times past, just allow the Holy Spirit come now and to heal every hurt that you've ever received in your life. Help him to take every rejection that you've ever been rejected in life. Why? Because God does not reject you. God loves you. God accepts you. And God is just healing hearts here tonight. The Holy Spirit is very gentle. Just give him your heart now. And he will take hold of your heart in his hands that were nailed to the tree. And his hands that were nailed to the tree has hold of your heart right now. He has hold of your soul, of your memories. And he's just taking them all away, one by one. Every hurt is taken away. Every rejection is taken away. And he's replacing it with his love, his peace, his joy, his acceptance. God is just holding you in his arms right now. Just receive that from God. And we're going to close now with Holy, Holy, Holy. Now this song, the words are coming on the screen. And so far, this through this song, I've seen five people receive literal healings from God. As we were singing the song, they were singing the song, and in the middle of the song, the power of God came in their bodies and healed them. Uh, I was doing a concert in Jersey, and as we sung this in Jersey, after the concert, after, after I've sung this song, three people came to me. One woman came to me, she said, I have to tell you this, in the middle of this song I felt the power of God go through my neck. For 20 years they've not been able to move my neck physically. And in the middle of the song she felt the power of God and she said, Look, I can turn, I've never moved my neck in 20 years. I thought, hallelujah. I said, that's because you were connecting with God in the worship. God saw your need and he met your need. When she finished, this woman came, my knees, I'm in pain 24-7, in the middle of the song, all the pain went to my knees, and I'm no longer pain. Then a guy came for I came here limping on this floor, look at it, hallelujah, all the pain's gone, I thought, glory, oh, put that song on again. <laughs> and then I was doing a concert in Astley, uh, not long ago in Astley, and uh, we sung this song, at the beginning of this meeting, this 82-year-old came in on crutches like this, 82-year-old. At the end, he came running to me at the end of the song. I have to tell you this. I said, you don't need to tell me anything. <laughs> he came running, he said, look, your crutches in the earth, all the pain gone, look. He was bending, he said, I'm 82, look at that. Oh, and he was healed straight away in the middle of that song. When he finished, this woman came to me and said, I've been having heart trouble all my life. In the middle of that song, Jesus came and I felt Jesus doing heart surgery on me. I went, glory to God! And she said, I'm, I'm breathless all the time, but look, I'm fine, I'm fine. Glory to God. So, as we sing this song, if you need a feeling of anything in your body, just ask the Lord, as we sing in this, just say, Jesus, I ask that you'd heal me now. And you know, nothing is impossible with God. And for you who will be watching the videos in the days to come, if you need healing, as you sing this song, just reach out to God in your home where you are and just say, Jesus, I receive your healing. So get ready, the power of God is here. The Holy Spirit is here. And he can do anything. So let's sing this song. Holy, holy.
holy, holy. This is the last one. Let's stand up for this. Let's sing this song. Let's stand it up. Glory to God. Holy, 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 holy is the Lord God Almighty.
and that you would draw people out of darkness and into your light. For the people living in darkness have seen a great light, a light has dawned. And Jesus, you are the light of the world. And I pray, Lord, that every home will be delivered out of darkness and into your light. Pray that you bring the people to come into this place, that they may be made disciples of you, Jesus Christ. We ask it, Lord, for your glory. Amen. Um, we're going to close the concert now, but we're still having uh, there's tea on the go, there's donuts in the background. Donuts are coming out now. Uh, help yourself. And as John said before, this is the family. And in a family's home, if you want a brew, you go make yourself a brew, don't you? <laughs> so, in a family, don't, ask, don't wait to be asked if you want a brew. Go make a brew. Yes. If you want a brew, go make it. Yes, and as well in a family, you can put your own rubbish. <laughs> and in your own family, you can do the dishes. <laughs> <laughs> uh, but I'd like to thank everyone uh, for helping today. Uh, thank you for Steve O for coming and doing the sound. Thank you, Gareth, for the filming. Uh, thank you, John, for your help week in, week out. We've been shut down ages ago without you. Uh, thank you for John, James, for your support. John. <laughs> thank you for everyone. Thank you for our uh, main director of CLMI at the back. The head of CLMI, he pays my wages. <laughs> and uh, uh, thanks to Martin for buying the album tonight. Um, <laughs> so if anybody just bought a free album, just get them uh, be free. Uh, so anyway, we'll get tea and a coffee. God bless you.